did this bad. So yeah, I've got um, my Ipsy bag and I'm super excited to open it up. Um, it feels kind of heavy this time, so I'm like really excited to see what's in it. And I'm feeling the actual bag itself and it feels very textured, so. Oh my, it's very textured. It's like my uh, backdrop on my um, selfie station. But anyways, the back side's like a little leather. Let's see on the back, so that's cute. I actually could like use that as like a little clutch or something. But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead, whip it open and see what's going on inside. And I can't wait to see what's in it. Cause like I said, it's heavy and it's like noisy and feels like there's more than five things in there, but I'm sure they, they stayed with five. Anyways, here we go. All right, so here we go, opening it up. I always like to get the card out first. This one says, uh, it's for December. Oh, by the way, yeah, we've been well in December. This is December's and I still haven't made my video to the uh, makeup applying of November. So I'm backed up. But anyways, I'm at least gonna unveil it here. Be merry, be bright, be bold, be you. Yay, that's December. So yeah, I'm tossed out. Okay, so getting into the good stuff. Like I said, it feels like there's more than five things in here, I don't know. All right, first thing I grab is the poor professional poor primer huh. so it's basically a face primer that minimizes the looks of pores like that. so yeah that's that okay here we go second item oh, I can't even show the thing it's a box I don't know what my my camera angles up with anyways kiss and smick smink 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 what the hell ever the everything it says on the top i have no idea what this is i'm wondering it better not be freaking nail polish it says mineral oil on the side what is it it's heavy is it blush it seriously does not say what it is Maybe it's one of those things that could be whatever, but um, it's made in Libertyville, Illinois. I wonder if that's far from me. So yeah, that's kind of weird. I'm guessing it's lipstick from the way it felt. It was very like creamy. It's kind of highlighty looking too. I don't know. I'm gonna say it's lipstick. That's weird. Okay. Moving along, I fill up utensil, which is always good because I can always use more of these. And I actually had to disinfect all of mine. Kind of long, the bristles themselves. I don't know. It's nice, I'll use it. I don't know, it's weird. So yeah. A small little brush. I use on my eye area. Okay, here's another box. One, two, three, four. So this will be fourth thing. It feels like there's more than two. There's a lot more than two things in there. So yeah, they did put extras in there. Maybe because of the holiday. That's cool. Um. Okay, renewing eye cream. I'm not too excited about that. I mean, I probably do need to use some things like this, but I just. Uh, it's like the same packaging as the other little thing. Why is my camera like tilted weird? Anyway, so a little pack of that. All right, we're still digging. Okay, this is for sure lipstick. <laughs> hmm, frozen lipstick. I don't know. It's probably gonna be shimmery. I'm not missing out. It says. Since it's got, oh, okay, it's probably red. We'll see how this goes. I want to feel like, I feel like it's gonna, if it's frozen lipstick, I'm wondering if it's like shimmery. I'm opening it. Oh no, oh my gosh, what is this? Okay, that is so weird. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, it definitely has like a shimmer to it. And then it's got the red in there, but bottom of it does not look anything like what the tip of it looks like so 
but oh, I can see, yeah, it's just like an outer edge of that shimmer. So yeah, that is that deep red. I don't know how that's gonna look. It's a really cool color though. I can't wait to play with that. Neat. Thank you, Ipsy, for the extra goodies. I think there's one last thing left. Um, <clears throat> Steve Laurent loose powder. I'll take it, that must be like a foundation or something. But it's tiny, so probably not. What the hell is this? Why did they not tell us, like we all are supposed to be so fancy and know what these things are. This says loose powder, so I guess it's like a eyeshadow. It's kind of like my last one I got something that was like a loose powder. And I was like, I don't know what it's for. It looks like it's got a cover on it, so I have to get that off. Anyways, that color is an intense. It's like a bronze. It's like the outer color of this thing. It's like bronzy. Very neat. I am very excited and, and it all came in my very bronzy, fancy, glitzy bag. That's so cute. But yeah, I'm excited. I know I don't really sound too excited because I'm kind of like, what is this? What is this? Oh, it's hard to get that back on straight. Anyway, so I'm going to get these up where they need to be for a picture. You know me. So yeah, I'm probably not even going to put makeup on today. I'm just, I'm not in the mood and that's okay. There. Hey everybody. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to play in my December makeup. <laughs> so I already got, um, started because, um, I don't want to make the video as long as I did last time. I went and cut between everything I put on my face and then I went and explained it. So I'm just going to kind of do it in chunks more so this way. Um, I've already started with um, in the December Ipsy bag. It came with a pore minimizing what's it called? <laughs> Primer. Um, it did have a little bit of a tint to it. Um, it didn't cover um, much of my redness but it did it did actually fill in some of my pores a little bit but I still can see my pores so it's still whatever but that's okay um but I did like it It was really smooth really silky it just glided right all over um I had a mild tint to it like I said but nothing nothing too intense um and then um this I'm not going to be trying. It came in the December Ipsy bag. It has it's an eye cream. Um, I read it and it's for in the morning and at night. Um, I don't really um, know if I'll use that at all. I mean, it wouldn't hurt anything, but I currently don't use eye creams at all um, or anything. But maybe I should. Maybe it'll help with all my dark circles. Um, I went ahead and moved on to what I already own, my BB cream. I already put that on my face, so I have smoothed out just a little bit, but, um, um, it'll be much better when I move on to my, um, I went and got some more. It's, um, let's confuse me. Um, it's a powder, loose powder, um, mineral, mineral powder for, um, uh, my foundation. Um, I found that works best for me because I don't like to... I like the lightweight. I don't like to wear makeup. Um, so um, when I do, I would rather have um, a loose powder than um, a cream or anything else. Um, I was going to put this on because um, the Ipsy bag actually comes with five things every month, but it had um, six items for the month of December, I assume for um, Christmas. Um, I thought this was a lipstick. Um, it says on the cap of it, the brand, I guess, is Kiss and smink or something like that um so i um didn't know but it came in a tube and i was like looks like lipstick but it was really weird applying it and then once i did apply it um it definitely wasn't lipstick the way it glided and stuff i'm, I'm thinking it's an, it's an eyeshadow <laughs> so anyways but it was kind of a pretty color but since you know it's not a lipstick it really wasn't um, setting on the lips very well um, so um, I guess why I got this on the other things I will be applying from the December Ipsy is um, uh, it's an eyeshadow it's antique olive is the color but oh there's a Steve Laurent so 
Oh, I can see myself in myself. <laughs> Anyways, Steve Laurent, it's a pretty crazy color, so it's gonna be even pretty intense, I think. But I think it's gonna help bring out my hazel. And they did actually include a uh, brush this time. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and um, probably just use this brush for the Steve Laurent eyeshadow. So I think that should, hmm. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be kind of different. Okay, yeah, I am gonna use this and the Steve Laurent. I think I'm probably just gonna lightly dust the Steve Laurent and like innards and stuff. Um, because also, um, the last thing I have from this month, December of Ipsy, is this crazy lipstick. Um, I know when I made the video, when I got it and opened it, I explained it, but I'm really excited. It's like an, it's like a really rich red, and then it's got a, um, like a bronzy, outer coat so I'd imagine it's gonna look kind of cool can't wait to try that out so I'm gonna go ahead and get in this and like I said I'm not gonna make it as long as the last video I'm not gonna be um, popping every little detail in there of what I put on my face um, I also am very excited because last time I made my video I didn't have my loose powder mineral oil and I also not oil but foundation but I also didn't have my um, Mascara. <laughs> Sorry. My nose is just my mascara. So I actually got went and re um upped all my mascara. So I'm so excited for that. Um so this face should be a lot better, but still you never know. I'm I'm good at butchering the <laughs> the makeup gig thing, job, whatever. I'm good at butchering my face. Um so I'll just go ahead and pop on here um after I get some things on and done and I'll keep it shorter and sweeter and just share my December Ipsy bag with whoever cares. <laughs> um, oh, also I want to say I love the card that came with it this time. It's be merry. I'm trying to read it backwards. Be bright, be bold, be you. That's so, so me. <laughs> All wrapped up in one card. So um, I'm going to go ahead and get this stuff on my face and then take my pictures and all that good stuff. <laughs> hey, so, okay, so I went ahead and jumped ahead and I got bronzer on. I've got blush on. I know it looks like a mess. It'll look better once eyes are all done. And then some highlighter on. Um, all of these products were actually from Ipsy, some previous, previous months of Ipsy. So all of the products that I have on my face besides a couple um, basics are all Ipsy products. Well, not basics, but... There is just mostly Ipsy on my face. <laughs> and oh, I already, I finished my eyebrows to it, uh, by the way. Um, so yeah, and that was done with my new Ipsy wand. So I'm just, you know, using my Ipsy stuff, having fun. <laughs> so I'm back. <laughs> I went ahead and put my eyeshadows on. Um, okay, so this thing has been confusing me pretty bad. Um, I think, um, I, th I think it might be like a highlighter. I really don't. It might, it might honestly be an all over. I can Google it, but I don't really care that much. But um, I think it might be like an all over. So I did actually kind of use it as a highlighter. And then I started to put it um, by my brow bow. But it's just weird. Um, I did try to use it as like an eyeshadow. But uh, I don't know. I don't like how it glides pretty much anywhere. But I'll have to look up a tutorial if I really want to find out. Um, I went ahead and... Um, the Steve Laurent by itself is obviously pretty intense. It's pretty coppery and um, um, kind of just like a, I don't know, not really too uh, much of an all over color, but I did use the lightest color in my um, smoky quad um, to kind of blend with it, just to make it a little more dimensional. Um, so now I am gonna move on to my um, mascara and eyeliner. <laughs> hey, I'm back. So I just wanted to talk about, <clears throat> well, I went ahead and put my mascara, eyeliner, and I think there's something else I put on. I can't remember. Um, so yeah, this, I swear, is the best eyeliner ever. Um, I had to look at the brand. It's L'Oreal, um, Infallible. Um, it's so easy to work with, and I'm like such a suck ass at, um, applying anything, but... I just have to say, I love that stuff. I, I believe a couple of my girlfriends use it. I think I've seen it in their collection. So um, I'm super excited about it. But anyways, this is a frozen lipstick from, um, him, no, hashtag I N M. I don't know what it says. Anyways, it looks like it is. So anyways, I, I'm gonna go ahead and put that on and I feel like I forgot something. 
But anyways, this will be the end of it. This will be the last. And I will show you how it looks. And I'll probably take the red lipstick off after a couple pictures because I don't know if I could do two weeks in a row with red lips out in public. <laughs> so, so I just want to show this. This stuff is like crazy looking. I'm so excited to see how it goes. I should record myself putting it on, but then I'll jack it up even more. So, oh my gosh, it smells like peppermint. <laughs> I'm just like in like this lipstick is like the coolest thing I've ever seen. It smells like peppermint and I'm sure it has a nice flavor too, but okay, I'm finally putting it on. So this is it. It's done. Um, I actually really like this lipstick, um, except for it does have the peppermint um, burn and peppermint taste and flavor of smell, all that stuff, but that's okay. Um, so it's kind of like a cool in. That's why I guess it makes it frosty. Um, I went ahead and put on the red part of it like normal, but then I did actually flip it and just, just <laughs> popped on that bron uh, coppery bronzy color on my bottom lip. Um, and it seems like it's gonna just mix in anyways, but I think it will give it that little hints of, mm, you know, bronze, met metallic, I don't know. So that's it, this is my Ipsy face. Uh, <laughs> my Ipsy face for December. Thanks for hanging in there if you did, and um, until next month. <laughs>